stars and our solar system moon and phases of the moon in this chapter we are going to take a look at stars and our solar system you have already studied about the earth you know the special features on earth that make life possible on earth the temperature on earth is just right the atmosphere is perfect and there is enough land and water for life to survive so there is life only on earth in our solar system what is our solar system our solar system is made up of the sun and all the things that orbit it the planets their moons the comets the asteroids and whatever other matter there is that orbits the sun what else do we see in the sky at night we see so many stars during the day the light of the sun blocks out the light of the stars however when the earth turns away from the sun the stars can be seen in the night sky on a clear night you can see about 3000 stars you can see many more with a telescope we can see more objects when we are away from the city as the glare from the light blocks our view of the stars all the objects that we see in the sky are called celestial objects the moon the biggest object that we see in the night sky is the moon it is our closest neighbor in space let us study a little more about the moon the moon is the only natural satellite that the earth has it helps reflect sunlight at night it keeps rotating around itself and revolving around the earth If you have a calendar like the Kala Nirnay or if you check in the newspaper every day you can get the period of moonrise collect this data for one week and write it down you will see that the time of moonrise changes every day by how much does it change it changes by roughly 50 minutes the moon rises about 50 minutes later every day On a full moon day the moon rises as the sun sets on a new moon day moon rise and sunrise happen roughly together why does this happen this happens because the position of the moon changes with respect to earth on a full moon day the moon and sun are opposite to each other with respect to the earth that is why moon rise happens with sunset On a new moon day the moon and the sun are on the same side of the earth hence moon rise and sunrise happen together why does the position of the moon keep changing that is because the moon revolves around the earth as the earth revolves around the sun and there is something very interesting about the revolution of the moon look at the moon carefully You can see a pattern of craters on it. Do you know something very special about the moon? We can only see one side of the moon. It doesn't matter whether you live in India or America, you can always see only the same side of the moon. Seriously, it is true. Look at this photo which shows the different phases of the moon. If you look closely from one new moon to the next you will see that you are always seeing the same side of the moon so we always see only one side of the moon do you know why this happens the moon takes almost the same time to complete one rotation around itself as it does to complete one revolution around the earth 
scientists have a special name for it. They say that the moon is locked to the earth. That happens when the time of rotation is the same as the time of revolution. We call this system of taking the same amount of time for a rotation and a revolution as being locked. And yes, we are not the only system that is like this. Both of Mars's moon, Phobos and Deimos, always have the same side facing Mars. All of Jupiter's, Saturn's, Uranus's and Neptune's moons are locked to those planets as well. And in a really weird case, Pluto and its largest moon Charon are locked to each other so that both always show one another the same face. This is the side of the moon visible to us from Earth. This is other side of the moon that we never see. This picture was taken by a spacecraft. Can you see the difference between the two sides? Now, you know a little more about the side of the moon you will never see. What did we just learn? The moon spins about its axis and revolves around the earth. The time taken for the moon to rotate around itself and revolve around the earth is the same. So only one side of the moon always faces the earth. If you like our videos, do share them and subscribe to our channel. If you want awesome quizzes, write to us. Keep watching and keep learning with Walnut.